I guess it's pretty much like uh, anything I would do on a train, I, w I would do on um, canvas or, or I choose to paint on. I'm still using spray paint. I'm still using like the same basic technique um, as painting trains, just about. I think it's pretty much the same thing. It's just been scaled down much, much smaller. And this one's called Sands of Sands of York. It's um so letter B. There's a painting under this that, that I went over that I did in 1980. I didn't actually like it. It was called I Love New York. But I decided to paint this over it. I like it much better now. I could scale down letters like pretty easy. You know, I did pieces probably almost this size on a train with, with Aaron. We are really doing like some real, like small pieces. Like, they looked like they were like chiseled into the subways because the way they had the 3Ds going down. And actually like way below the window. I have really no problem scaling them down the canvas. Compared to like um, a piece on a train, this is like a, it's like a miniature dude. <laughs> okay, go ahead. And this one, me and a fellow named Ramel Z did. Um, this one is the, the armored letter E. And um, he sort of has his own beliefs about that. And um, why he arms, arms um, letters. What, to arm a letter? Yeah. Um, just so it could um, defend itself, actually. Because um, he says um, the Christians put a Catholic symbol on the on a letter and the only way to destroy a symbol is with a symbol so um, in order to destroy a symbol you have to arm a symbol and he thinks by arming um, letters this some um, just Christian symbol will be destroyed I hate, I hate getting into Ramelzi's religion and shit it's like too deep for me and shit Ramelzi would smack me for, for even saying something like that I think this is an arrow um, which is actually fires, and this is like um, some type of like maybe machine gun you would have. It actually shoots um, rays. And this thing is also like a machine gun. And this piece right here, this is like a like gauge or hinge. And this thing is supposed to actually do a full 360, so it could even like defend itself from behind or side or that whatever. If it was if it was actual, you know, if it was real. This would be a this would be a weapon. This would be a tank, actually, as as he would put it. And this this particular letter would be able to um, defend itself from like writing writing graffiti on trains and like trying to take an art class. You know, it's like, <laughs> well, I just couldn't do it. You know, I I couldn't see myself doing it. So I, n I never really took an art class. But then, okay, see, like. Then there's like, then there's like a graffiti, um, it's not really lore, but um, it's like a, if a dude's like using it, your style, you definitely know it, and like everyone else knows it, you know? But um, in, in our class, it seems like that's accepted or something, you know? To like use other people's ideas. I mean, mostly all the writers who write now have been busted once already, or twice, or what have you, you know? As before, like in old writers, like, if you got busted, you just quit, you know? You don't, you don't want to be out there, like, getting busted, you know? That, that was like, I mean, that was, that, that was like, I mean, you, you didn't know the yard, or you just didn't know what you were doing or something, you know, if you got busted. And that's how, like, old writers look at it, actually.